first select the front plane start drawing the sketch taking the dimensions of one side of the profile of the piston because it is axis symmetric we can use revolve the boss commands so take the dimensions and draw the profile of one side of the pistons use expert dimensions vertical dimensions horizontal dimensions complete the one side of the profile of the piston you can zoom in or zoom out the figure means profile must be closed then only you can revolve you can use the revolve commands we can align the edges like this complete it now it is closed it become a gray color now you have to draw the center line select center line draw the center line at the center itself now we can apply revolve you got the piston now we want to draw the projections for gajan pin piston pin so you have to select the reference plane right plane as a reference press control button drag it create another plane at the center take write the time dimensions 130 it is in the middle
you can select the sectional view like this we want to create one more plane parallel to plane 1 select plane 1 press control button drag it and it is of the rtmm there we have to create the particular circle and extruded commands this is plane 2 normal to start drawing the circle in that plane 2 select the midpoint drag it draw the circle correct the diameter and ver vertical distance vertical distance center of the circle to top of the piston is 130 it is in the middle Now we go for features, extruded bows, extrude up to the surface, up to the surface, we select the surface, click on the surface. extruded in the opposite direction so flip the direction then draft 5 degree so draft must be outward direction click on outward direction ok now the projection is already we got the projection now you want to cut the hole for that again you have to draw a circle in the plane 2 then we will make use of extrude cut commands draw the circle Take the middle point, midpoint, draw circle, diameter is fifty six. vertical distance is 130 middle then go for features extruder cut to select extruder cut you select through all options then it made the cut
a groove for fixing the circlips so for that we will draw one take the sectional view then you can easily see that particular point now you select sketch center rectangle you have to edit the dimensions of the rectangle we cannot select that particular edge because there is no edge actually in that particular point you are seeing the sectional view really there is, actually there is no edge there so we have to correct the dimensions of rectangle we can change the view for convenience smart dimensions calculate the distance from the top of the piston 1 or 2 height of the rectangle is 3 mm revolve cut command select the center line as reference rotate it revolve cut and you got the groove for circlips now we can use mirror commands so it is symmetrical so use mirror commands select the mid plane as the mirror plane 1 then you select all features extrusion cut then circlip groove everything all features to be selected then ok you will get all features on the left side now you have to give the fillets You can hide the unwanted planes. Select the edges correctly. Then you give the fillet 35 mm. Select the edges carefully, you fill it as 5 mm. Now we want two more fillets, one is 8 mm, other one is 5 mm. You can rotate the objects as you like but you have to select the edges carefully
now you can save so if you click that button it become full this time section symbol if you press again it become section view again save the drawing give some name save now you select open new drawing select a4 size paper browse the objects drawing you, before placing you ensure that it is a hidden line shown then you select the proper view you want a sectional view actually side view isometric view and you want the sectional view in this case we will take one sectional view because to get the details you want a sectional view you select the sectional view here select the section properly place it on the object tick mark drag it you will get the sectional view you can give dimensions and change the name drawing name edit the drawing name by clicking on sheet give the name as piston then drawn by write your name type your name here other details roll number class and all exit from sheet you get you can see the drawings save as pdf files thank you for watching the video